sure they missed the cut, but U.S. Open local qualifying at Country Club of York served Blake Hinckley and Billy Stewart well. The Philadelphia PGA section professionals leaned on that experience en route to the top of the 117th Open Championship leaderboard. Hinckley, who plays out of Wilmington, and Stewart, the 2018 Open champion, carded respective four under par 66s Tuesday at York. The more rounds you get under your belt out here, it helps a lot. You know there's birdie holes out there, but it's a course that if you hit one errant shot, it can easily turn into a bogey. The course is in great shape with all the rain and heat that we've had, so we're just able to get aggressive in a few spots and then in other spots just kind of take what the course gave me. For his part, Hinkley hit a wedge 105 yards to 8 feet for birdie on the par 4, 384 yard 18th hole to finish at 4 under, tied with Stewart. For his part, Stewart birdied three of his first four holes and rode a confident putter throughout. You know, you guys do a great job setting it up. There's always, you know, some tricky pins. You know, it, it, it's a nice challenge, but always fair. So the mentality for, you know, the first round is really just, I, I like to try to get myself up there, you know, in the top 10, top 15, and then see what happens tomorrow. Hinkley wants to see what happens with golf as a career. How far can he go as a player is the question he seeks to answer. And growing up, my first job was at a golf course and then I was caddying since I was 15 or 16. So, you know, just kind of wanted to stick with it, give it a run, and uh, I'd rather fail at something I like than kind of be successful at something I don't like. Stewart, a teaching professional at Union League Liberty Hill, wants to reach that competitive summit once again. His last win being the 2018 Philadelphia PGA Section Professional Championship. I love teaching and a lot of people look up to me as an instructor because they know that I know what it's like to be nervous. I know what it's like to compete. I know what it's like to really want to succeed in this game. So, you know, at the end of the day, I, I like to compete and also and, and win tournaments. So to finally get back into contention here after this round, it feels good. Setting a shot back of the co-leaders is Little Mill's Troy Venucci, round one's low amateur. Michael Little, the event's defending champion, sits tied for 18th at one over. 17 players finished at even par or better on day one. The cut line stopped at 75. Round two begins tomorrow at 7.30 a.m. For Yak TV, Tony Regina.